when you think about rebuilding diesel engines, how has the trends changed over time along with all of that change to the engine platform? Okay, there's always a drive for more power, right. better efficiency and better emissions. So the next step moving from an aluminum piston was to go to a ferrotherm piston, which was a forged steel crown mated to an aluminum skirt held by the pin. This allowed you know, higher peak cylinder pressures, higher temperatures that the piston could withstand uh, to be able to, to meet you know, higher or more uh, or just better emission standards. Yeah. Then shortly after that, they, the emission standards increased even further and pistons became all steel. And what most people don't realize, you know, you think about a steel piston, well, that's gonna be heavy, mm -hmm. but a monotherm, which is a single piece steel piston, is actually about 30% lighter than the steel and aluminum combination. Okay. Now, when it comes to rebuilding, there's only a few manufacturers that can make this type of steel pistons with all of the features and benefits that you find on a Molly piston. 